Hi, I'm loving the sunny weather right now, but um, yeah, that really doesn't give us an excuse to wear sunglasses indoors because I probably look like a prick. So we're on to the second Ask Jamie video now. Um, I think I'll probably do these around once a month. I think it's a good idea because you guys get to know a bit more about me and I get to interact with you a bit more. So I've picked out some random questions that um, people want to know most on Twitter. So here we go. Deco Kid asked, do you wear pyjamas? No, I sleep naked. <laughs> if you don't sleep naked, then you're missing out on a lot of comfort and freedom. At Demolam asked, did you really put a jar in your arse or is that just a rumour? <laughs> right, I just want to clear this up. When people ask us how I got stuck with the name Jam Jars, I always say that it's because of one man, one jar and I pretend that's me in the video, but it's, it's completely a joke. The person in the video is like an old hairy man. So, yeah, that's all good. Um, at Bonnie NG asked, do you have a girlfriend? Um, no, I'm single at the minute. Actually, I'm gonna be single forever. Honestly, I don't have time for a relationship. Uh, I think they're a bit pointless at this age. You've got to go out, have fun, experience loads of different things. And how are you supposed to do that when you're tied down trying to be in a serious relationship? Like. Props for people that can make it work. What qualities do you like most in a person? Um, honesty is always number one. I can't stand liars. It sounds weird, but I like people that are a bit awkward and a bit shy. I'm sort of attracted to people that don't have much self-confidence because, oh, as cheesy as it sounds, it sort of like gives you a chance to make them feel good about themselves because if you date someone that's really arrogant and loves themselves, then how are you supposed to make them feel good when they probably already feel great about themselves? Um, Rhiannon Seagull, I think that's how you see it, um, asked, how is your skin always so clear? Photoshop? <laughs> Jordan Page asked, what's your favourite pizza topping? I'm actually really boring, I don't like onions or peppers or any salad or any vegetables or anything like that so I'd have to see barbecue chicken probably um, maybe with a few jalapenos on and that's about it <laughs> Cornel Keenan asked have you and Harriet ever went out or nearly went out? When we met about four years ago in school when she moved to my school um, it started off with us sort of liking each other and going on dates to the pictures and stuff but um, we ended up just being really close friends and as much as we act like we're in a relationship now, like we're always with each other, um, we'll get jealous if like the, the person spends time with other people and stuff like that. Um, but I don't think we'd be in a relationship because we wouldn't want, um, we wouldn't want to ruin our friendship. Our friendship means more than like something going wrong in a relationship I guess. Berthen Erin 709, I hope I pronounced that right, um, asked the top three things that annoy you most. The thing that annoys us most is probably when you hold the door open for someone and they just walk straight past and don't even look at you, don't even smile, don't even say thank you. I think that's so rude. It really doesn't take much to say thank you. The second thing that annoys us most is people that are always claiming that they heard that music first, that they listened to that band first, that, um, that they wore these clothes first and how they complain when everything turns mainstream. Um, I just think it's so pretentious and annoying, like, who gives a fuck? Little Megan 96 asked, if you could change one thing about you and your life, what would it be? Um, if I could change one thing about myself, it would probably be how easily I get jealous. Um, I absolutely hate the feeling of jealousy. What would I change about my life? Um, probably where I live. I would love to move to London. And the last question that I'm going to answer is from Chill Toffer, I think. And it says, are you a boy or a girl? Um, rude. <laughs> 
I don't know if that was a serious question, but I am actually a boy, even though I often get mistaken for being a lesbian. But I probably bring it on myself for wearing t-shirts like this. <laughs> So that was Ask Jamie this month. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up so I know that you're enjoying it. Bye.